Hello, everyone. Welcome to our lecture today. So in this lecture, I want to introduce a really important relation, which is unary relation. So for unary relation, as the name suggests, so that means this is a relation defined on several sides. So here, in general, if we say unary relation, it means we should have uh, n, n sides defined here. So you can see I denote this from A1 until AM. And then same with our definition for relation. And the relation is also a subset of the product of this uh, domain of the sides. So here, because we have n numbers of sides, so this n relation actually is a subset of the product between A1, A2, until AN. Okay. So of course, similar to our relation, so here we call this uh, n size a1 to a n as the domains of our relation. And n is called as the degree of this relation. So now you can see previous we learned the relation defined in one side, uh, in two sides, like a times b. So that actually means that relation is with degree two. So here for the n relation, this is a more general version of the relation. So it's with a degree as n. So let me explain this with this example. So for this example, you can see we have a relation defined as R1, and this is a relation of three sides. So this all of the side as an integer number denoted by z. So we have this relation is actually a subset of the z times z times z. And then how many elements we have for this relation? We have three. So all of this is as a tuple. So we have this uh, three elements as three tuple. So we have one, two, three, which is our first element in the three relation, R1. We have four, negative one, three. Both three number is come from our three integer, integer sides. And we also have another element in our relation as 0, 8, 200. Okay, so for here, for each of them, you know, for the first element, this is from our first Z, the second element from our second Z, the third element is from our third Z. So you can see this is our A1, A2, and A3. Okay. So now this is an ex uh, example of the n relation. So n relation is still a subset of a product between the sides. So the only difference is now instead of a product of two sides. So here we have n of the n numbers of sides. And then when we write down the elements in our relation here, it's uh, how many elements we have here in this parenthesis. This is just the same with our degree of this uh, relation. If we have this as a product of the uh, three sides, so here we should have three elements in our parentheses here. Okay, so this is a uh, definition and explanation of the unary relationship, uh, unary relation. So hopefully this is clear for everyone. And in next lecture, I will continue introduce our relation I will introduce how we can give the representation of the relation by the matrix and also by the diagram. So hopefully I'll see you in next video.